as a manifesting generator, my will in order to manifest and to take on the human design aspect of the generator, my ideal action would be to respond, to respond to life, to respond to whatever comes my way, to assess it, to double check on the energy or the offer at hand. And this is why it is essential for us to reevaluate our energy and to understand our human design. Okay, there's projector, there's mirror, there's manifester, there's generator, then there's manifesting generators. Okay. None is more important than the other. All the human designs really do play a big part in our world and our society because again, yes, we humans are tribal creatures. We're very communicative, meaning we as a whole, even if ideally separate with individual thoughts, are still part of a community, a conscious community, a collective. I guess the reason why I'm talking about this today is because as a manifesting generator, yes, my ideal action is to respond to life. This doesn't make, if you are one too, a manifesting generator, no, this doesn't make you lazy. This doesn't um, make you um, unprioritized. If anything, you are responding to life at hand. You have to feel deep within you and also in your sacral point, which is one of your major points that governs the um, manifesting generators to design, also as well as the active throat chakra. You are essentially the one who gets to feel out the energy before taking it on and integrating it in this world. So today, I was blessed with an opportunity to respond. And I really want to share this with you. And just know I'm very grateful for you, Michelle. And yeah, let me, let me go ahead and share, share this with you. Thank you so much, Father. Today I was gifted this. What this is, it's called a Scarlet Energy Magnetic Energy Bioenergy Energy Pendant. Okay? It just so happens to be in the Merkaba form. When I first started my awakening, the Merkaba, the Merkaba, was very prominent in my awakening. It has a big part to do with why I understood things as they are now. And to be given a chance to respond to something so great as this pendant, I don't even know how to take it out. That's how great it is. I don't even know how to take it out. I don't even want to mess with the packaging. It's so beautiful. Anyway, let me go ahead and read to you what this pendant is really about. Just a moment here. So, the SMB Energy Pendant is made from specially selected natural min minerals fused together under intense 1,200 degrees Celsius. Oh, there's a dragonfly flying around me right now. Uh, of heat with scalar magnetic and bioenergy. It encompasses the physical, emotional, and mental spiritual elements of life. It's not just any other energy pendant that you come across. It's a masterpiece of energy pendants. SMB energy pendant has been extensively tested and found to be one of the most effective and natural pain management systems in the world today. SMB energy pendant is designed to help the body expand its aura. Let me read that again. To help the body expand its aura. To increase harmony within the body and naturally fight off disease and illness using the subtle energies. I mean, that's amazing. I, I, the reason why she gifted it to me is because she knows I've been eyeballing it for a long time and it was selling for, I think, like 50 bucks at the shop. And I 
for some reason didn't have lack of thereof the funds for it which is okay I wasn't beating myself up for it but I always knew in my head that someday I was gonna receive something like this and yeah I was I was really lucky enough to, to receive this as a gift I mean not everybody that knows anybody gives somebody like something like this you know what I mean so I'm definitely gonna use it during meditation today and see how it feels and yeah remain grateful for the invitations such as projectors get you know the mirroring such as um, the mirroring the reflections that mirrors get or do for others as well as responding and initiating but yes yeah, so I just really wanted to show that life can really come to you when you allow it to and it can come in something seemingly so small but something that has a really big impact so I'm really grateful for this thank you source thank you universe thank you Michelle thank you to my guides for leading me to the shop because I actually on the way to this spot here I think that was a falcon Okay, I don't know what. Oh, it was probably a gray hawk. Yeah, that was a gray hawk. I hope y'all saw that on camera. Anyway, life is waiting for you. Go ahead and go at it. And like I said, I would have most likely never came over here if it wasn't for my guides, angels, intuition leading me here. Because honestly, the shop that I went to, it's called the Water Tree. And, um,. I would have never stopped by if something didn't tell me to stop by. I just wanted to say hi because I saw her outside of the shop just sitting there having a smoke. And I was like, oh, let me say hi to her really quick. And that's when she told me she had something for me that she was actually expecting me. And I was like, huh, you know? So it's just kind of things like that where you're like, wow, I guess I was meant to be here, you know? But anyway, I just wanted to share this with you and I really hope you're having a beautiful day. And if not, finally it's one thing that makes you beautiful. And if you can't seem to find one thing, look in the water. Look at the reflection in the water. Look at a mirror. Look at the reflection on your phone. That's, that's beautiful enough. Bye, speaker.